Hello, sports fans and football fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. And as I told you, I bought the uh, 2023 football game, well, the 2024 football game with the 2023 season. And uh, I also got the cards for 2023 and the cards for 1977. Those will be, I expect, on the way in the next day or two, and I should have them by the end of the week. But... Here is a look at the game. I downloaded the game because uh, the release date for that was today. And so this is the 2023 NFL season. Um, you can see all of the teams right there. And uh, we will take a look at some of the player cards in the system because I did get the card image. For the uh, for the game, for you know, for all of the teams. So we're going to start with uh, a look at the and let me move myself over here a little bit. We're going to start with a look at the Chicago Bears because that's my team, and we will go to the computer manager, I believe, and you can click on the player. And so we'll take a look at Justin Fields' card. You click up here and you say player. And then you look at the card image, and then it's got the run, the pass. He doesn't have any special or field goal, um, I don't think, um, cards. But this is his running card. You can see the must run is uh, pretty pretty good. And really, I mean, even his line buck and his end runs, those are good. And, I mean, it's Justin Fields, so you would expect it would be. Uh, we look at the pass. Now, here, here he is passing. Of course, he wasn't the greatest passer, at least not last year. Um, you know, I still think he was coming into his own. I think the Bears gave up on him a little too early, but that's, um, that's his passing card. So we'll get out of that, and we will take a look at Tyson Badgent. And, uh, he's the backup quarterback, and it, really his card looks a lot like, um, a lot like, um, Justin Fields' card. So you can see here's his running card. Now his end run, he can't end run. But his line buck is pretty good, and his must run is also pretty good. Uh, passing, he's uh, obviously he's a little worse even than Fields, although he did have some good games when he was uh, playing for the injured Fields at the time. But, yeah, nothing special there, so we'll close out of that. Um if we look at their, um, let's see, if we look at, yeah, we're going to get out of that, and then we go to uh, team and the notebook, and we look and uh, we can see that their defense versus run was good, and their defense versus pass was average to poor, and really they came on in the last, few, like down the stretch, they came on uh, hot. Like they were really good defense at the end of last season, uh, but they did finish seven and ten, only scoring three hundred and sixty points and allowing three hundred and seventy nine. So that's what their defense was rated. So let's take a look at the Dallas Cowboys. And again, I'm just going to really look at quarterbacks, unless there's some running back that was really great or a standout. Um, um, you know, I'm just giving you a quick overview look here. So. Team, uh, computer manager, we'll go to for Dallas, and the quarterback, Dak Prescott, we'll look at his card, card image, uh, line buck, and his running, his run, actually his running, his, even his must run is pretty good, but again, he can't end run. His passing card, obviously, a lot better than Fields. He had, he was a, he's, he is a good passing quarterback, and a very good quarterback overall, so... That's that. Um, let's see. Uh, let's take a look at Tony Pollard. We'll take a look at his card. Uh, card image. There's his line buck off tackle and then run. So this is what you would get with, uh, with Tony Pollard. Uh, I'm not sure if he had a really good year last year or not. Um, so let's see. Who else we got? Uh, I guess we'll move on from them, but we will look at their defense. We'll look at the Dallas defense team. 
um, notebook. So they are average against the run, and they're good against the pass. They were 12-5. and five, Had a good season. Uh, let's take a look at Miami. I know there's probably some Miami fans out there. Um, team, we'll look at the computer manager. We'll look at Tua. So Tua Tagliavola, we'll look at his player card. That That's his running card. Again, he can't end run, but he does line buck. And he has a, a decent must run. I mean, you'll gain yards all the way down through 10, but he's not going to get any big breakaways like, um, you know, like Fields could get. His passing card, though, uh, pretty good here. You got a double long gain on a long pass at 5. Um, and you got some, some good results if you're wrong guessing the pass with him. So we'll close out of that. Um, let's see, what do you got? Uh, Jaden Waddle. He was a good, really good receiver, from what I remember. Yeah, 1,000 yards receiving, a 14.1 yard average. Uh, that's his running card, which he does not have much going on there. You know, I mean, actually, this doesn't look all that great for as good as he was. Um, I'm kind of surprised. This is there's a lot of misses there on that one. Um, Ty, let's take a look at Tyreek Hill, another really good receiver for them. He had 1,799 yards for a 15.1 yard uh, reception average. And uh, that is his receiving card. Now, his receiving card is very good. He's got a long gain. He's got two long gains on wrong on short pass. Um, obviously, he's got that nice double long gain there at seven uh, on long pass. And he's even got a long gain on flat pass if you're wrong at three. So, yeah, I mean, I expected him to have a really good card. Let's see. Um, let's see what Miami is uh, for their defense going to the notebook. They are good against the run and average to poor against the pass. So... Uh, we'll take a look. I know that uh, there are there's at least one um, one Arizona fan that might be watching. So we'll take a look. Let's first take a look at their defense with them. Uh, team notebook. They are poor against the run. Very poor against the pass. Their record was four and thirteen, so they were not good at all. Um, team. Let's see. Um, Computer manager. We will, of course, look at their their main man, Kyler Murray, the quarterback. Uh, he had a, a 5.5 rushing average, and he was 65.7 completion percentage, which is pretty good. Um, so, yeah, let's take a look at his card. That's his running card, and he can end run. And, of course, it's Kyler Murray. You would expect he probably could uh, definitely end run. And his must run is good. You got a plus 33 up there at 2, and you got a 15 and a 14 at 3 and 4. Um, and you're gaining yards all the way down to 10. Passing card, uh, not too bad if you stay away from the long pass. He uh, leaves a little, I think, to be desired on the long pass. But short and flat. Yeah, he's uh, he's going to be a good one. So uh, that is that's that for um, Arizona. Uh, let's look up um, let's look up Baltimore. They've got some some guys. Let's see here. Computer managed. Let's go to the notebook. They were good to excellent against the run and excellent against the pass. They were thirteen and four. Let's go look at their. Um, Computer manager and uh, quarterback Lamar Jackson. Let's take a look at him. He uh, had 821 rushing yards, so I expect he'll probably have an end run. Um, and he's 67.2 completion percentage and 3,678 yards passing. 
Uh, yeah, there you go. He's got an end run and uh, two short gains at six and seven if you're wrong. Plus, the must run is also nice. Look at the pass section. He's got a lot of must runs here, but as we just established, the must run is, is, is good. It works for him. Uh, flat pass, a lot high, high completion percentage on the flat pass. Um, and the short and long, even really, um, if you're wrong, um, nice completion percentage. And there's, you know, three long gains over here if you're wrong. So that's nice. Um, let's see who else we got to look at. Let's look at Bal Buffalo. Buffalo. We'll look at first the um, notebook. They are average to poor against the run defensively and good to excellent against the pass. They were 11-6. and six. Of course, you remember they got off to a bad start and it looked like maybe they would be questionable for making the playoffs, but they finally did. And so let's go to um, Let's go to the computer manager and take a look at that. Got Josh Allen there. Um, excellent quarterback. Had a lot of running yards. Obviously, he ran probably more than a lot of quarterbacks do. Um, he had a 66.5 completion percentage. There's his running card, and he can end run. He's got a nice must run as well. And his passing is pretty good. He, and he is a good passer, but you can see this interception percentage is kind of high. He, uh, or this interception rate on the card. He's got an interception right at 9. And then on long pass. And, um, and at 10 on flat and short. So um, that would be something to watch out for. Stefan Diggs. Let's take a look at Diggs. Um, I'm trying to hit some of the main players here. You know, I know the video can only be so long, so if you don't see somebody that you were looking to see, you know, um, yeah, maybe you can make a request and I'll do some of the other teams that I didn't do and some of the uh, other good players. So, yeah, Diggs, uh, really great at sh catching a short pass, especially if you're wrong. If you're wrong, he only misses on seven. Um, and, and really, even on the flat pass. Um, the long, he's, you know, there's some misses there, but he's not too bad if you're wrong. So, that's that. That's Buffalo. Uh, let's look at uh, Houston, because Houston was an up-and-coming team last year. Uh, we'll go to the computer manager first, so we can look at the man, C.J. Stroud. Um, he had a four yard rushing average and a 63.9 completion percentage for 4,108 yards. We look at his card, he doesn't have an end run, he didn't run that much. Um, line bucket not bad and the must run is not bad. It's not like some of these other guys that we looked at that are real, you know, great running quarterbacks. But this is good, it's, it's a good card. And then uh, the passing of course, he, you know, Stroud had a great year. Uh, great rookie year for him. Um, you've got a high completion percentage over here in the flat pass and the short. Um, even like even really wrong. You've got six and seven, and then he can must run on eight and uh, double gains on ten, and uh, and and a nice card for the long pass too. So uh, we'll get out of that and. We will take a look at Houston for the um, the notebook to see the defense. They were average to good against the run and average to poor against the pass. So, you know, take that for what it is. Uh, let's take a look at Jacksonville. The team will go to the uh, first. We'll go to the uh, notebook. They were good to excellent against the run and poor against the pass. Nine and eight last year. And uh, so let's see. We'll close out of that. And then team computer manager will take a look at their uh, quarterback, Trevor Lawrence. 
player. Um, he attempted 564 passes for 65.6 completion percentage and over 4,000 yards passing. Doesn't have an end run. Not a big runner. Um, the must run is nice, especially if you can get hit, hit a low number. And his passing was, eh, I don't know. I mean, that's not that great. Uh, there's a lot of misses there. Uh, but, you know, I mean, he's he's not Josh Allen. He's not, you know, um, uh, uh, Jackson. He's not some of these other really great quarterbacks that are in the league. So, get out of that. Uh, who else we got to look at? Um, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if there's really too much else to look at. Let's take a look at Washington. Um, let's take a look at their computer manager and their quarterback, Sam Howell, new guy. And uh, let's see. Let's see his card. He doesn't he doesn't end run. He is he was a scrambler. The must run is okay if you can hit a lower you know a lower number, but once you hit anything like seven and above, it's not that great. Uh, passing um, not that great. Um, yeah, I don't think it's that great. Uh, he but he was leading, I think he was leading in passing yards. Earlier in the season, like through the first half of the season, he was leading in passing yards, I thought. But anyway, uh, so there's his card. And then we'll, uh, we'll look at Washington from the standpoint of their defense. Um, the notebook, go to the notebook. They were average against the run and very poor against the pass. I thought they would be a little better than that. They had a decent defense. And they were 4-13. And they uh, allowed 518 points. That was a lot. So I guess, yeah, you got to make it's got to be you got to reflect that somehow. Um, but anyway, uh, that's it for me. Uh, this look right now. Like I said, if you want another look at some other teams, let me know. You can always do that. But for right now, that's going to be it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.